Hello everyone and check out what I just got in the mail today. Been waiting for this for months. Enclose is your OpenAI private beta API key, blah blah blah. And here's the API key. Gotta make sure I blur it out. So I've been thinking about what to make now that I have this incredible power, and the first idea I had was making the command line easier to use. So I got to work. Basically, the idea is that instead of constantly Googling for how to accomplish various tasks on the command line in Linux, I want an AI-powered shell. I'll tell the shell what I want to do, and the shell will figure out the actual command to run. Over the course of a year, this could save entire minutes from my typical workflow and could be a huge win for AIs in their quest to obsolete humans. As you can see, there's not a whole lot of code that needs to be written. OpenAI provides a Python library to access their API, but it's really just doing simple HTTP requests underneath the hood. Now, let's try it out on some basic stuff. Often, I need to use a tool that I'm not super familiar with, so it's hard to remember how to run it, especially with converting or working with specific file formats. OpenAI can help out with that. And it can help us with stuff online, too. Even better, if we don't specify some details, it'll fill it in for us. Note how we didn't need to specify which file system type or even which hard drive to format. That's super helpful. It can also figure out commands that require multiple steps. Well, A for effort, I guess. OpenAI's model also has an incredible ability to hallucinate URLs. You can just ask it for something, and it'll imagine where you might be able to download it. Did, did OpenAI just rickroll me? The best part of all this is that OpenAI's models are stochastic, which means that there's some randomness in the result. You might get different commands for the same request, and I find that that really keeps things fresh and exciting while I'm working. I wish I could put this online for everybody to try out, but I would need approval from OpenAI to let more than five people use it, and there's a charge for each request. The examples that I demoed cost about one cent each to run with their most powerful model. But if you have a command that you want me to try running, let me know in the comments below. I want to make a follow-up video with those requests, so subscribe if you want to see it when it comes out. Thanks for watching.